Welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I have, well, you can barely see, I have a bunch of products here. I have had, so I'm gonna move. <clears throat> I have had so many people ask me about my hair routine and what I put in my hair, what I do to get my curls to look like they do. This is my hair, fresh out of the shower, uh, no product in it at all. Um, I'm actually getting it blown out Wednesday, so I don't want to waste my product if I'm not going to have like a three, four day curl. Um, but I thought I would tell you guys my holy grail products that I'm current, that I'm currently loving for my curly hair. It was just way too many things for me to sit there and like type out in a comment. So I thought I would just show you and whenever people ask, I can just refer them back to this video. So first I'm going to go shampoo and conditioner. Um, I use Oloplex. My hairstylist actually told me to get this because I have really, really just dry, like a dry scalp in general and dry hair. And when I moved to California, Northern California, since the air is drier, I feel like it made it a thousand times worse. So I told my hairstylist that and he told me to get this and I've been really, really loving it. So it's just the Oloplex. For the shampoo, it's number four. Um, it repairs, strengthens, and hydrates all hair types. Um, so that is what I've been using for my hair. Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't even know if this is sulfate and all that stuff free. When it comes to curly hair, you really should be using stuff that's paraben and sulfate free. And I honestly don't know if this is. But I can say I've been using it for like two months now. And my hair does not feel dried out like those products are in it and it's really really healthy so yeah and then for the conditioner i just use the number five i use the number five oloplex conditioner so i use these two together i also only wash my hair once a week twice max if something strange happens with my hair but like i do not shampoo my hair regularly it's like once a week because it's not good to constantly shampoo your hair um if it's curly because it'll dry it out more so another thing that i use on the back end that i think is really important is hair masks so i've been using this hair perfector um it's another oloplex one. Oh yeah this is what it looks like uh this bottle is really really tiny as you can see it's almost gone um i uh, before I shampoo my hair that one time a week, I will put this in my hair and leave it in for like 20 minutes and then get in the shower, rinse it out, shampoo and condition my hair. So this has been really, really good. Um, I think it's really important to do hair masks with curly hair um, just to keep it hydrated and healthy. Um, the next thing that I use that I, like I love this stuff so much, I've repurchased it like countless numbers of times. It's the Garner Fructis Hyde hydrating treat one minute hair mask Say i'm on like four day curl and i don't i've already washed it for the week i will put this in my hair in the shower leave it in brush through my hair get out and my hair always looks so good when i use this like there's just something about this that my hair loves and it smells so good mm, yeah it smells so good and there's so many versions of this and i've tried like this one and i think the avocado one and they both are great and i love them so i highly highly recommend this like i love this stuff and it just does wonders for my hair when i use it i feel like all my best hair days are the days when i'm like i wore curls for four days so then when i get in the shower i wet it down and i put this in and brush through my hair my hair always looks so good after that so if you're gonna buy anything that i talk about Buy this because i absolutely love it it's so so good so next i want to talk about like the products that i put in my hair after i wash it after i deep condition it and the order that i put them in because i think order is very very important so the first thing i do is i get like a leave-in conditioner like moisturizing cream this is the one that i've been using and i absolutely love it I don't know how you pronounce it. Um, it's A-D-W-O-A, <laughs> Adwo Beauty. I have no idea, but this is their Bowman Moisturizing Curl Defying Cream. It smells so, so good. Um, but this is what I put my hair first. So it's kind of like that leave-in conditioner. It gives my hair the moisture that it needs. Um, so this is first. So put in your moisturizing leave-in conditioner cream products very, very first. And then after I put that in, I take this, which is the BB Curl Style Conditioning Mousse. 
Um, so I just take a little bit of this and it's the Bumble and Bumble, oh, so BB, Bumble and Bumble, that's what it is. Um, I take this, you can see my hair is like all over all of these products and this is almost gone, so I really need to get more. But I take this and I just put like one pump in my hand and then spread it throughout. So next use your, your um, like curl defining mousses, whatever you use, um, use that next. So leave-in conditioner, styling cream, and then after I do that, I take this gel. Really, really, the light's reflecting on it, but I really love this gel because it doesn't leave my hair feeling like hard and it doesn't leave it looking like I have gel in my hair. I just take a little bit, like maybe the size of a dime, and I just put that through my hair. So this is the Miele, M-I-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. <laughs> I don't know how you pronounce it, but pomegranate and honey coil sculpting custard. This is actually really cheap. So like all the products that I have here, aside from the Oloplex are very, very affordable and they're not very expensive. I used to use Diva Curl products um, and they are so expensive and they were drying out my hair. So do not, do not, do not, do not use Diva Curl anymore because they are not here for the curly haired girls. They like changed their formula or something. I don't know, but my hair was so dry so unhealthy and i was so confused because i thought i was using like the right products and as soon as i switched it got so much better so anyways miel really cheap you can find it at like sally's beauty i'm pretty sure you can find all this stuff there um maybe not the oloplex i don't know but the rest of the stuff you can find there because it's all super super affordable which i love because curly hair products can be so expensive and when you're using it a lot and it's something you have to replenish a lot it's not fun <laughs> it's super expensive so none of this stuff is like outrageously expensive too so very affordable then the last step so you put in your deep conditioner you put in the mousse you put in the gel the very last step is to put in oil i've been using the uh coconut milk oil um this is what it looks like it's really gross you can see my hair probably all over it I don't know why it's not focus. Uh, yeah, you can probably see my hair all over it. You see it's almost gone. Um, this is what I put in very, very last of my hair. And then that's pretty much it. Like that's, that's what I put and what I use on a regular basis. I don't, that's it. And then something else is scrunchies. Like I use scrunchies on my curly hair. I don't use anything else because it it's just not good. I use a cotton t-shirt to dry my hair instead of using a regular towel that's really important that keeps it from being frizzy i find when i'm like at a hotel and i forget to bring a t-shirt and i have to use like a normal towel to dry my hair my hair always looks bad it always looks frizzy like it is not good so do not use regular towels to dry your hair if you have curly hair it's so so bad honestly even if you don't have curly hair it's like not great to do um and then the last thing i will say is take your vitamins i take all vitamins i take their probiotic i take their um multivitamin like normal one and i take their beauty one and let me just vitamins <laughs> do so much my skin has gotten like insanely clear since i started taking vitamins my hair has grown like two to three inches since i started taking vitamins and i think a lot of it also has to do with being in quarantine and my hair always being up so i wasn't damaging it because i wasn't going anywhere or doing anything like my hair was just always in abundant and protective hairstyles but vitamins are so important so take your vitamins drink lots of water too i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know in the comments or on my instagram if this works for you and if you guys like these products um because i absolutely love them i've been using them for a really really long time so i hope you guys enjoyed i hope this was helpful i hope that these products work for you and you can get in the groove with your curly hair i will catch you in my next video Bye.